you know, junior national champion Katie Valdez. And I know it's not the way you want to finish the match, but you won another title out here and talk a little bit about your match because you got that late takedown to, to tie it up and take the lead before they had the injury call. Uh, how, how do you feel you wrestled today? I feel like I wrestled really strong, had a lot of technical things I need to work on, but just another day of wrestling, just stuff I got to work on back in the ride practice room. Yeah, talk about this season. I mean, you couldn't wrestle a high school year with injury. How hard was that for you to sit out, knowing how much you love to wrestle and, you know, you like to go and wrestle all the big things, right? Yeah, it sucked, but it helped with my mentality, like, help me stay mentally strong and focus on the mental aspect of wrestling instead of the physical aspect. So, Katie, when did you get back on the mat? Um... Or how much training did you have before Fargo? Uh, about a few months. Okay. Yeah, you were able to get a couple of tournaments in, but you couldn't go to the state tournament in high school. And, you know, we, well, you went, you were wearing all kinds of things like on your legs and stuff, right? <laughs> yeah. much, it must, it must have been hard to watch, though, wasn't right? it? Yeah, it sucked, but it helped me learn how to study my opponents properly. Talk about that, uh, that throw that you, they gave you that take down to tie 4 4. How did you set that up? I knew how she was pushing in, and I knew like where she would put her head, and I knew like as soon as I felt the right pressure, that I, the throw would open up. With your knee injury, has it prevented you from doing anything like that or anything else? Have you had to change anything about your game? Not really. So, I mean, um, talk about what's next for you now that you've been able to get back, win a national title here. What are you, what are you looking forward to in the next phase? Uh, making a U20 world team. And that, that'll be the goal for next year. Anyone you want to shout out? I know you get a lot of support and help out there. Uh, my parents, my mom and my dad, and my coaches. Who helps you the most overcome this injury? Not just the physical part, but all the emotional and all the psychological stuff that goes with it. Definitely my mom and my dad and my coach, my head coach. What, I mean, I, I'm just trying to understand how tough it was for you when you were overcoming. Uh, it, was, it was pretty rough, but I had a strong support system helping me throughout the entire thing. You take a little break, or we jump right back into training? I'll jump right back in. Well, hey, congratulations. It looked like you really have confidence in your wrestling again, all right? Yeah. Outstanding. Thank you, Katie.